Hello viewers, today I'll show you a very easy spicy oven baked sea bass recipe using tandoori masala spices. The recipe is called tandoori sea bass. For this recipe, I will be using three sea bass fish that I have descaled, cleaned, and gutted. As you can see, the fish have been totally gutted. I'm just going to put a few slits on both sides of the fish so that the spices go in deep and the fish cooks easily. Score the flesh of the fish in the way I am showing here. Let's season the fish with salt. Lime juice. And chili powder. Rub everything in well both inside and outside the fish on both sides you might need to put a bit more salt chili and lime juice on the other side of the fish rub it all in and then set it aside for at least an hour That's our fish marinated. Now we are going to make the second marinade. In a mug or a bowl, add 5 tablespoons of yogurt or dahi. One tablespoon of tamarind paste or tamarind puree. Two teaspoons of garlic powder. Two teaspoons of ginger powder. One teaspoon of cumin powder. One teaspoon of coriander powder. One teaspoon of garam masala powder. A bit of black pepper some carom seeds or ajwain, one teaspoon of sugar, a bit of mace or javitri, and three to four tablespoons of oil. Mix everything together with a spoon until everything is nicely blended and that's our second marinade done pour a bit of the marinade in a baking tray and spread it about with your hands Now it's time to add the fish into the baking tray along with any juices remaining in the plate. Then add the rest of the tandoori masala paste to the fish. Rub the marinade all over the fish. Put some of the marinade inside the belly of the fish as well as in the cuts.
make sure you do it on both sides spray some oil on top of the fish or just pour a bit of oil on top if you don't have a, a spray oil can now we need to put a foil on the baking tray and seal it very nicely now we are going to put the tray in a preheated oven 180 degree centigrade fan oven for at least 20 minutes after 20 minutes take the tray out open the foil very carefully and see if the fish is done and the fish looks 80% done use a brush to baste the fish with its juices but since the spices have dried out a bit I am going to pour a little bit of hot water into the tray to deglaze the tray. Now put the tray back in the oven without the foil for 10 minutes. After 10 minutes, take the tray out. As you can see, the sea bass has browned a bit and is ready to be served. Sprinkle some freshly chopped coriander leaves and serve with either naans or on its own. Enjoy! <laughs>